Well, tonight, people living in a mobile home park at Buckeye Lake say they want to know what's killing cats where they live. Since Mother's Day, residents say they found nine dead cats, and this is not the first time this has happened. 10 TV News reporter Kevin Landis joins us to explain why residents believe the cats were deliberately poisoned. And we have to warn you, some may find the details difficult to hear. Kevin? Well, Jerry, there's no proof the cats were poisoned, but people in this mobile home park believe that's what killed these cats, who they describe as having seizures, foaming at the mouth, and other issues. Someone or something is killing cats in this Buckeye Lake mobile home park. It just don't make no sense to me. They were in extreme pain. There was nothing they could do. They just lay there writhing and rolling. Whoever's doing this, I think it's cruel and inhuman. Tim White says he's found most of the dead cats, including this one that died later. We found three underneath my next door neighbor's trailer. There's three of them over here at my buddy's house. This is the M section of the trailer park, and those who live here say this is the only place where they've seen cats dying. Why here? That's what people here want to know. If it was a disease, it would be spreading to the other sections. Nobody else has been reporting any of this happening. So it's localized to this general area. Residents say they have no evidence the cats were poisoned and police have no evidence either. So far, none of the dead cats has undergone a necropsy because no one wants to pay the cost. As for people like Tim White, he says he can't bear to see another cat die in his arms. It's awful, man, awful. Residents say whatever is killing the cats happens very quickly and none of them has been saved. Those who live in the mobile home park are urging residents not to leave food out. They believe that's how they may be getting sick. Kevin Landers, 10TV News.